Asif from Saudi Arabia is saying that I've been worshiping Allah Azza wa for the past 17 nights and reading Quran, doing my taraweeh, uh, trying to make dhikr, giving money in charity, but I don't feel the difference. Akhi, you're not supposed to feel the difference. This is like someone hitting the gym for the first couple of weeks. And we see this often. People come and go. And we know that this person is not going to last for long because he keeps on fixing what he thinks is a muscle in front of the mirror. And he did not at least stay six to eight months to see such a, an improvement. So likewise, you need to devote a lot of time and be patient until you reap the fruits of Ramadan. What do we mean by that? The Salaf used to say, I struggled with prayer for 20 years and I enjoyed it the second 20 years. So the first 20 years, I've been praying on time in the first row, trying to have my submissiveness and khushur to the fullest. I fail and succeed. I fail and succeed. But after 20 years, it all turned to be good and positive, and I have enjoyed it for the, 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 the second 20 years. So now it's been 40 years since I, I've started. Likewise, in Ramadan, we do our level best. We don't know when the right moment will strike and our hearts will, will illuminate with Iman and light. We do our level best. When you pray taraweeh with the Imam until he concludes it, Allah gave you the reward of praying the full night. When you recite the Quran and engage in dhikr and give money in charity, Allah would uplift and raise you in the levels of Jannah. You don't feel that now, but you are in the right direction. So keep on doing good deeds. Increase your recitation of the Quran. Try to devote time to learning the meanings of what you read. Engage in dhikr. Stay in the masjid more often. So if you don't, if you pray Fajr, try to stay until Ishraq and pray two rak'ahs. If you uh, uh, finish work at, in the afternoon and you go Maghrib, for example, to pray, try to stay until Taraweeh in the masjid, reading the Quran, making dhikr. Stay after Taraweeh for a couple of hours. Now we, we're approaching the last 10 nights of Ramadan. Try to plan to do i'tikaf. All of these things uplift you, but... When you allow Satan to mess up with your mind and say, what's the use? I'm not feeling any motivation. There's not much energy in my heart. So all what I've been doing is to waste. Might as well quit. This is what Shaitan is trying to do with you. So be careful, Asif Bhai, and keep up the good work.